So I get quite a few writing related questions um, every week, but unfortunately I don't always have time to answer, you know, all the emails. So what I thought I'd do is make some videos with the most common um, writing questions. Okay, so here we go. So the first question I get asked, um, and have a list here. So the first question I quite often get asked is, how do I write a book? Um, and the answer to that is you don't start out trying to write a book because writing a book is, you know, it's a big thing. It it's, can be quite intimidating. So what I generally tell people who are just starting out, who are beginners, is to write something smaller. You know, write a short story or even just write a scene or, um, you know, a moment. Um, I quite often will tell people to start keeping a journal and it's a creative writing journal and basically you write in it um, you write something creative in it every day whether it's a couple of paragraphs about I don't know, a beautiful flower and oh what if that beautiful flower had a world inside um, so just anything that comes to you you write it but you write it every day and it's both it's building your mental muscle um, you know to do with writing because a lot of writing is just turning up and, and doing it you know, every day or five days a week, whatever your schedule is. Um, but yeah, start out with something small. And then once you you feel like, oh, okay, you know, I'm starting to get this, then you can move on to like a novella or a, like a smaller um, novel. Um, you know, not everyone can write small. I know writers who just naturally, you know, uh, write big from the start. And if that's you, then you know, go for it, totally go for it. Um, in that case, you know, you basically have to remember you're writing uh, a story and a story has a beginning, a middle and an end. Sometimes that's in one book, sometimes that's across a series. But all stories basically have that general structure. So um, so that's, I guess that's my advice for someone who is, uh, you know, beginning at this right, at writing. Um, first of all, don't pressure yourself to... Um, you know, write a huge thing all at once unless that is your natural inclination. Um, it, most people will tend to start out with something smaller um, and build their way up to a bigger piece of work. Um, and also, um, write what appeals to you. And, and I quite often hear um, the advice to write what you know. Um, and that is good advice because it is easier when you're starting out to write about things, you know, for, for which you have personal knowledge. But I will admit that I have never actually met an angel flying across New York. <laughs> and I write about them all the time. So don't let that, um, I think when people say write what you know, um, sometimes it's taken quite literary, literarily. <laughs> um, but quite often it's about emotion. So we all, there's been moments in your life where you would have been sad or you would have been happy or excited. Um, so mind those kind of things when you're writing um, whatever, a, a, a science fiction or a thriller or anything. So when people say write what you know, it's not necessarily um, like your everyday life. It could be elements that you have from your everyday life that you can put into your work. Um, and yeah, and have fun and, and don't judge yourself. Like I, a lot of new writers will write to me and say, hey, you know, I wrote this thing and it's um, it's terrible. It's not perfect straight out. And I'm like, gosh, I wish my stuff was perfect straight out. I edit over and over and over again. So the first draft doesn't have to be perfect. There are very, very few people who can write an absolutely perfect first draft. Um, and we all hate them. <laughs> <laughs> but most of us, you know, that's what editing is for. So um, you write your first draft, you know, just go for it. Um, give yourself freedom. Don't judge what wants to come out. Um, you know, I don't think, oh, this story's never going to work. Or um, if, it, if, if it speaks to you, then, you know, there's going to be other people in the world that it's going to speak to. So, um, yeah, so write, have fun, and don't pressure yourself. All right, I hope that helps.